Stories are told of spirits, ghosts that inhabit statues, or stay bound to a tree, or haunt a house. These spirits and ghosts, for some compelling reason, will not, if ever, leave. And they will fight to protect their property. Haunted houses, trees, and caves abound with vengeful spirits and playful ghosts. We stay away from them when we know they are there. But what about ghosts that haunts a very small object that is handed down the generations to one person, then the next, and the next? An object so unsuspecting. Our bracelets. You'll be right. And I'll see you tomorrow. Then. Are you ready? Can we go now? Yeah. I'm just, I'm just gonna get my friend. Is he the one? Yes. This whole story actually happened uh, in my family. It happened on my auntie, who is uh, my mother's older sister. Uh, she one day just get very obsessed when she saw this uh, cheap bracelet. She had a very strong urge of buying it. Um, how are these for sale? This comes from my family. Very old, real and thick. I'm categorizing them now, so they're not for sale yet. What about this box? This? Yes. Oh, this is just a cosmetic box. It's not for sale. But I have some pretty boxes behind. You might want to take a look. Do you think I can just take a look at this? Um, yeah, sure. Can I have that? How much? It's not for sale. It's, it's just a box. The bracelet... I have not seen it before. I... I don't know. I can't sell it yet. It's just a simple bracelet. It looks like stone or something. Forget it, Ling. It's probably some maid's cheap bracelet. 500. It's all I have for me right now. Plus... Plus what you have. You let me first? It's not worth that. It's not for sale. Come on, it's it's just a stone bracelet. Then why do you want it? And pay so much too. You crazy or what? I like its feel. So old and ancient. Like someone many years ago. I was like one this and was happy. No, better not. It might be an antique. In your dreams! That stone thing. I would have paid five dollars for it. Give it back to him. Let's go. No, the bracelet and the box, five hundred. And my watch. No, your watch is worth more than a thousand dollars. Deal. Done. What's so late? Have you eaten or not? Hey, what did you buy? It, it's just an old cosmetic box. Shall we? It's nothing. It's not here. Where is it? What? My bracelet. My bracelet. Really? Where is it? What? My bracelet. A stone bracelet. Is it expensive? No. It's just stone. What are you doing? 
I must have dropped it along the way. Are you sure it's here? Yes, I passed by here just now. Just keep looking. Keep looking. It is not for you. What? What are you talking about? My bracelet. You found it. Give it to me. Wait. You come in here. Stop it, old man. You come in here now. Ling, stop it. What's wrong with you? It says luck and love finds us at the most unexpected of times. So too with tragedy and pain. But for Wei Ling, what she found that day was more than unexpected in more ways than she ever imagined. She says she saw a lot of wild scenes. She's very restless during night time, right? She couldn't um, rest herself and uh, fall asleep. very worried about you. Go away. I just want to be alone. Willing, stop. Stop. Please. Don't be like this. You say you love me. Where am I? Jack, what, what are you doing here? There's something wrong with you.
cannot take it anymore, Auntie. It's killing me to see you eating like this. I'm sorry. It just... No. Please don't go. Wailing is much calmer with you here. Only you can handle her. She only listened to you. I don't know why. The rest of us, she just ignore. Please, Jack, stay with her for a while more. We are trying to get her some help. <sighs> I love you. Come back to me. Seeing you like this, just killing me. Let her go! Please! Whoever you are, let her go! Please! Let me talk to her. Let me tell her. I love her. Willing? 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 Why have you come like this? Huh? It's okay. It's just that you've changed. drove me crazy. You drove all of us crazy with worry. saw a lot of uh, things in her house and she herself also felt very sick after that. At the end she went to seek help from some religious uh, bodies um, in order to remove the jade bracelet. She's my daughter. The ancient Chinese scriptures shows that it belongs to a royal family. You mean that is a real antique? I don't know. But if it's real, jewelry made for the royal family are protected. So, Jake plus royal ownership? No way. Then how do you explain my daughter's condition? I can't. I see no signs of possession. All I see is a very weak woman who needs to eat and rest. Then, can you at least help her to remove her bracelet? Oh, sure. Let me check with the temple. Maybe there's something here after all. That was not meant for her. I cursed it. 
so that no one would ever take it away from me, except if they suffer as I did. It's mine! Really? It is not for her. The bracelet? Do you know something about the bracelet? A jade bracelet, possessed of a spirit, and unwittingly taken in by Wei Ling. Seems that love was the bond, her love for Jack, and the ghost's love for her lover. A forbidden love. A doomed love. The bracelet? You know something about the bracelet? She was just a maid until a prince fancied her. grew to love her and gave her a priceless bracelet as a gift of love. It was forbidden for her to wear as only the royal family can wear this. But the foolish maid wore it and the queen found out and decided to punish her. The queen, in contempt, put the bracelet out of the maid's reach and declared that the maid could have and use the bracelet if she could get to it, which meant that the maid would be accepted as royalty, become royalty, become the prince's love. The maid defied pain and managed to reach the bracelet. Furious, the queen revoked her promise and took the bracelet away. Not for you! What's wrong with everyone? I suspect from the psychological point of view, right, it may be a sense of guilt that she is actually she broke the taboo by wearing something is not meant for her, and and this guilt can uh, create a lot of uh, you know uneasiness in her sleep and so forth. 
um, the funny thing is she's still keeping it but, but not putting putting uh, beside her as her personal belonging but I, I, I remember she said she kept it safely in her drawer. The bracelet still exists in the possession of the family but no one dares to remove it or wear it. It remains safely locked in an old cosmetic box. It's mine. Studios Production for Channel 5.